So in this video, I'm going to show you a couple of different ways for adding long strings of positives and negative numbers. The first one we're going to, I'm going to call adding like signs. And if we're going to be adding like signs to find this sum, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to collect all of the positive numbers. And here's a positive number and here's a positive. So 9 and 4 is 13, so that's positive 13 plus. And then I'm going to collect all the negative numbers. So here's a negative 4, here's a negative 2, and I add them together, I get negative 6. So then I've got positive 13 plus negative 6. Now it's a little bit more manageable because this string is a little long and kind of in intimidating. But if you collect the positives over here, collect the negatives right here, and then add them together, you get positive 7, piece of cake. All right. Another option is instead of collecting like signs, you can collect the opposites. All right. The opposites. Same problem, so we better get the same answer. Uh, so in this case, we see that negative 4 and positive 4 are sitting here. Well, those guys, if we add those together, we know we're going to get 0. Because you go down 4, you go up 4, you're going to be right back where you started from. So you're going to be at 0. Leaving just positive 9 plus negative 2. And that's easy. Positive 9 plus negative 2 is positive 7. So we're done. So, of course, we get the same answer because it's the same problem. So you have two options. You can add like signs, collect all the positives, collect all the negatives, and then add. Or you can collect the opposites. So you got negative 4. Collect all the zeros is essentially what you're doing. And then you add whatever's left.